What's up, Transformers? This is Ben here in China, and today we're gonna take a look at the Make Fans Toys MF21 Super. Now there are two versions of these oversized legend scale toys. One having the more toy accurate metallic finishing, and the other having the more cartoon accurate gray finishing. But because the toy version of Swoop has the blue body and the toon version has this red body, I am going to kit bash and replace this red body with this blue body. That kit bash is in my other video which I will link somewhere up there. So taking a look at the toy box, here is the box from the front, from the side, from the other side, from the top and the bottom and the back. Now let's do some box comps. About the same height as the MP car bot box, but just a little wider. And the Max Fans Toys box is a little thicker. Taking a closer look at the Toon box box, you can see this nice artwork in the front. On the side, you can see the cartoon drawings. Here it is from the other side, from the top, the bottom, and the back. So here's Swooper kit bashed to give me the ultimate tuned accurate swoop. In the box you can find the instruction manual and these are the accessories that can go onto swoop. In the toy version of Super, you get this figure and, a, and an extra sword. The original sword is the translucent red. So first things first, you get this nice sword that is painted in silver. Nice details here. And to put it on, you just put it on like that. And you can swing it. Zoom, 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 zoom. He also comes with two missile pods. Because I took this from the toy version of Super, the finishing here is metallic and a gold finish here instead of it being yellow. And to clip on these missile pods to Super, all you gotta do is find this peg hole there and you just insert it very easily. Boom, you're done. Originally the hip joints here were a lot stiffer, but after I kick bash, I think it's a little bit loosey-goosey. But nothing that will affect Super from standing upright. Now the Toon version of the Max Fans Toys Dinobots has a lot of unpainted dark grey pieces to resemble the cartoon. And it has this very bright yellow part. So let's take a look at Super. Here he is from the front, from the side, from the back, from the other side. From the bottom and from the top. Initiating Viscan technology. Using my Viscan technology, let's look at the paint apps on Swooper. Here on the eyes, the face, details here, red here, silver sword, painted wings, missile paws are painted, eyes here are painted, shins here are painted, painted here, here and here. Employing cold sense technology. Let's look for die cast pieces using my cold sense technology. The metallic paint definitely feels colder to touch, but I really don't think they are any die cast pieces. Compiling Toon Screen Technology. Using my Toon Screen Technology, let's look for the cartoon accurate bits. Chin sculpt, head crest, contours here, color here, detail here, colors here, and the red stripes here. What about the non cartoon accurate bits? Missile parts a bit too large, lack of details here, extra details here, 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 color of the fist, lack of square details here, lack of details there, no visible dino feet here, sculpting here, the sculpt on the forehead here, the sculpt on the eyes, and the sculpt on the nose. All right, let's go through some articulation for Super. More than meets the eye. Autobots wage their battle to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticons, the Transformers. Robots in disguise, the Transformers. More than meets the eye, the Transformers. So here are the MacFans Toys Dinobots that I currently have. And here's how the MacFans Toys scale with Masterpiece, Bumblebee and Sunstreaker. And the Unique Toys Legend Scale Palm Collection figures. So let's transform.
So here we have Swooper transformed to the Dino mode. Looks pretty nice with the silver wings and the grayed out pieces and the cartoon yellow beak. The missile pods are a bit of a different color but it matches the color down here at the claws so I can't really complain. As for articulation, the head can move up and down, the beak can open and close, the wings can flip in two points of articulation and then the ball joints on the feet, the claws can go up and down due to the transformation joints. And that's about it for articulation. So here's Super from the front, the side, the other side, the back, the bottom, and the top. All right, let's do some comps. Here is Super with Sideswipe and the rest of the Megfans Toys dinos that I have so far. Initiating Viscan technology. Using my Toon Screen technology, here are the cartoon accurate bits. Color on the beak, crest, wings, paint over here. And for the non-cartoon accurate bits, the transformation for the dino legs here, the mismatch colors here, the orientation of the red pinstripes, lack of detail here, extra detail down there, extra stuff over here, extra details here, the position of the legs, and the sculpting of the eyes. So what are my final thoughts? Let's talk about three things I like about this toy and three things that I think that can be improved. And it's basically the same for all the Megfans toys Dinobots. First thing I like about this guy, fun to play and easy to transform. Second thing I like about this toy, it gives us enough of that G1 feel. Third thing I like about this guy, these legends are oversized and so it really will match your legend scale collection. Three things that I think that could have been done better. Keep the paint apps consistent. If you're going to give us these yellow bits, give us accurate bits here and here. Second thing I think that could have been done better. Don't make me buy two toys so that I can kit bash to get a cartoon accurate soup. Third thing that I think that could have been done better, some of the detailings here, here, over here, can be more cartoon accurate. So what is my recommendation? If you're looking for absolute cartoon accuracy, this is not it. But if you just want something small and fun to play with, and arguably more cartoon accurate than Defense Toys Dinobots, this is it. So what are your thoughts? Please leave them in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like and share button. Also hit the sub and bell button for more future videos. Again, this is Ben here in China signing off and I'll see you on the flip side.